Welcome to Woggle Guides. In this guide, I'll explain how you can quickly hide pictures on your Android phone. Let's get straight into it. I'm on my Android phone and looking at a page view of some of my apps. Android is a feature that allows you to create secret folders on your phone that only you can access and that you can use to hide any photos. This is quick to do, but it can be tricky if you've not tried it before. In this guide, I'll show you how to do that in five simple steps. I know that sounds like a lot, but I promise you it will be done in less than two minutes. In order to hide a picture on your Android phone, you need to open the Google Photos app. This is shown on screen, but if you can't see it on your phone, you can quickly find it by using the search bar at the bottom of the page. You can search for it by name. I'll tap on the app once to open it. Once in the app, you need to select the photo you want to add to the private folder. I'll tap and hold the photo to select it. A small tick appears in the top left of the photo to indicate that it's been selected. You can of course choose to add multiple photos if you wish by selecting them in the same way, but I'll just add this single photo to demonstrate how it's done. At the bottom of the app, you'll see that a list of options appeared when we selected the photo. I'm going to scroll all the way to the right of this list until I reach the Move to Locked Folder option. Let's tap on that once to choose it. A pop-up then appears that asks you to confirm that you want to move this picture to the locked folder. The photos will be removed from your general Google Photo display and can only be viewed by going into the secure locked folder that you'll access with your pin or fingerprint if it's set up. To confirm that, tap on the Move option. The Photos app then confirms that the picture has been moved to the locked folder. So how can you open the locked folder? If I go into the library option at the bottom of the app, you'll see there's a utilities button shown in the top right of the page. Let's tap on that to dive into it. A list of options is then shown, but we can find the locked folder at the bottom of this page. To access it, I'll tap on it once. Because the locked folder is a private folder, Google won't allow anything to be recorded, so I can't show you what happens next. This is a security feature, and all screen recorders work in this way. On your phone, you'll be asked to enter your phone pin or present your fingerprint, depending on how you access your phone. Once you do this, the locked folder will be open, and your pictures will be available to view. I hope you found this Woggle guide useful, and learned something new. If you have, please like this video or subscribe for free so that you can find out when new guides are available. Thanks for watching and do look after yourself until next time.